Okay. He looks like he's in bad shape. A oh, crafting part, something you often find in uh, a child's play area. Look at this. What is this like a what a weird slide for kids? Oh, I guess it is, isn't it? They climb up here somehow and then slide down. All right. Uh, I guess um, we'll go up these steps here. Oh, wait a minute. I haven't been in here yet. Uh, really? Is this it? Just go right here? I think it is. Access granted. Right. That was easy. Got a weapons cabinet here. <laughs> That's all that was in it. <laughs> supply crates. Okay, I picked up another supply crate. I guess we're going to get a, a mission here at some point where we're supposed to pick up some supply crates. Only shows one here, but I know doggone well that we've picked up two of them. Oh man, that old man, old man's prestige sells for a pretty decent price. Like thirty-one units. Okay. All right. So, for whatever reason, this little section right here isn't restricted. All right. Let's go to the Stedry Market. I'm sure that Stedry probably means Mark, and it's probably not pronounced Stedry, let's face it. Yeah, well, Tibor almost certainly is. I took some kind of uh, passcode, the key card. This is him. Or, I've got a good idea what it's for, too. And it is good So this is the guy. No, an elevator, useless to us. Unless we want to start a real war, which we don't. He's a small fish, for sure. And Dushan, probably not even involved, but uh, well, let's not throw either back without getting something out of it. Okay, check in later. So this is the guy that has the key card that we want. I need to figure out a way to take him down without anybody else seeing it. Can't pickpocket him. This is not Fallout 4. So we'll just have to hope that he walks someplace nice and secluded. Yeesh, look at that guy, it's a big deal. So I'm not being suspicious at all following this guy. Okay, he's walking back here, this is good. This is good. Oh, this is great. Was he going to the bathroom? Ha ha ha. Whoa, what's with the bodies flipping around? Hey, look! Here's some ammo and an she arc can. key card. Tell Miller the mission's back on track. I've got an elevator pass key that'll get me into arc territory. Copy that. I'll do a flyby up ahead. Get you the lay of the land. Hit me up when you're through. So we got this card now. A key card used to access the elevator in Ark's living quarters. Um. So we still talk to Lubosh. All of these things here. Why is this not highlighted now? Still don't have any uh, side missions. I feel like I'm missing some stuff here in uh, Udalek Complex. I'm sure I am. Well, that was great that this guy just decided to walk over here and use the restroom. At least I guess that's why he was walking back here. We're going to kind of tuck his body over there. Hopefully nobody will see it. I don't know what this is for. Oh, well, we could have shocked him. <laughs> That's why there was water there. I heard him walking through water. Could have shocked him, but that'll kill him, right? I don't want to kill people. I'm a good guy. I don't want to kill people. 
As far as I know, I haven't killed anyone yet in this game. As far as I know. Can I pick this stuff up to get in here? I want to get in. I guess I can't. I don't know if there's anything in there anyway. Uh, it doesn't look like it, but there is something right here. What the heck? You see that? Is it inside of this box? Oh, check this out! <laughs> okay, that's pretty cool. So if I really wanted to, I could just do this. Open for business! Got a sale going on right now. Well, there's uh, nothing interesting in here, so let's hop on out. Looks like they're closed. Looks like Samoob. Samoob Slucha is closed. I finally have some money and tried to buy oh. food. But there is no food. The shopkeeper told me all the vegetables he had left were rotten. I would have accepted them gratefully. Times are tough. I'm starving. That's not my problem. I can't afford to give away food for free. You have more food than you need. Hey, what about tomorrow? My business is the only thing keeping me from turning into you. <laughs> Go. My business is the only thing keeping me from turning me into you. Here's an ebook. Santo, Rise of a Corpo Nation, Growth. Santo's initial success has allowed them to quickly grow into an international company. Their early strategy for growth and a prosperous future was the acquisition of land, great swaths of cheap land in various countries around the world. Useless land, it was thought, land in the middle of nowhere. However, much of the acreage was lying atop freshwater aquifers. By the early 2000s, Santo Water was the major water treatment and supply conglomerate on the globe and controlled much of the planet's fresh water. The water wars were already won before they had even begun. For the next 25 years, San Santo Environmental acquired smaller companies and influence. Their expansion was meteoric, and their rise funded many fortunes. When the Earth's population boomed beyond the 10 billion mark, Santo was in position to take advantage. They diversified. Agriculture was the new game, and they had thousands of acres of land ready to be cultivated. Their water distribution infrastructure already in place, Santo effectively became the world leader in food production and distribution virtually overnight. The Santo Group was formed. Here on purpose? It was in the early days of this place. Nobody knew yet what it was really like. Her dad kicked her out because she was augmented, and my parents refused to take her in. She thought she'd be safer living here than on the streets in Prague. And you came with her? That was really good of you. I gave notice at work and followed her two weeks later. But by the time I got here... Oh, Jesus! Hmm. That's a sad story. We followed somebody here and I guess by the time he got here... I guess she was already dead. That's what we're supposed to gather from that. That's what I got out of it. Okay. No. Tohle se mi nelíbí. Yeah, same to you, lady. They think they can crush us, but the human spirit is strong. They withhold supplies. We make do. Already, we found a way to grow produce, even in this place. Not much, but it helps. All right, I like your attitude, buddy. Don't let them keep you down. What's going on in here? Whoa. A uh, memorial to friends and family? Can you believe that the people responsible for this, this prison want us to pay for the right to move to a free city? Yeah, somebody else said the exact same thing. I'll take your stopworm software. Ooh. And a credit chip. It's this way. Oh, this guy's working on stuff. Alright. No, nothing over here either. Market, um... 
really isn't that interesting. Hmm. Guy knocked out down there. Got some you food here. Something? Doesn't look too bad. What do you got? Uh, stuff that I have no idea what it is. Probably meats. Maybe a kielbasa, salami. Maybe, I'm guessing. Man, what is she doing over there? Pretty neat. That includes the augmented here who prey on those weaker than they are. And there are plenty of them. I agree. Is it windy here? Look at her jacket. <laughs> Look, it's so windy. What? Uh, uh, no thanks, dude. I'm, I'm not interested. What's up? Oh, who's this guy? Oh, this is the elevator guy. Is there something I can help you with? Um. You're Lubosh, right? Dushin Sokol told me Ark might have the answers I'm looking for. He sent me to you. Dushin? I heard the police had him and his brother Tibor locked up in the Narrows. Yeah, the cops were working Dushin over pretty good when I found him. Wasn't exactly a fair fight, so I stepped in. Is he okay? He'll be fine. Looking forward to sleeping in his own bed tonight. Not a lot of people in here would be bothered to stop and help out the stranger. What was happening wasn't right. You took on the police by yourself, on their own turf? And then Dushin pointed me to you. He was right to do so, but I'm sure he would have given you something more. Some wisdom, maybe? We <laughs> to remember what he told us. Before he's free again, a man needs to rob everything. After you take everything, a man is robbed of what makes him free. When you've robbed a man of everything, he's no longer in your power. He's a free he's free again. Well it was this one, right? No, I'm just kidding. We all know it's this one. When you've robbed a man of everything, he's no longer in your power. He's free again. Spoken like a true brother of the revolution. I think I even <laughs> heard conviction in your voice. I'll unlock the elevator for you. Go on up. So we actually had two ways to get through here. We could have spoken to him or we could have used the key card that we picked up. Let's just talk to this guy a little bit. How did you get involved with Ark? I used to load freight for the Czech Railway in Ostrava. After the incident, my employers were afraid of me. I was fired. So like most of the augmented in the country, I drifted into Prague, unlicensed and homeless. The police swept me up in a sewer raid one night, put a round in my leg and dumped me here. It wasn't long before Talos found me. And he gave you work? He gave me purpose. He's the reason I'm still alive. It's interesting that he refers to him by his first name. He just calls him Telos. Dushin said some of the police are using the Ruzika bombing as an excuse to hurt the augmented in Gollum City. Why do you think that is? They're trying to manufacture a response from Talos to get Ark to fight back. Violence begets violence. That's right. And if Ark responds violently, then their case against us only builds. But, <laughs> Talos is too smart. He won't allow Ark to be baited into a false confession, even if it means that the people we sworn to protect are hurt. Well, let's ask him about Talos Rucker. What can you tell me about Talos? First time I met him, he's cutting a bullet out of me while trying to explain the history of the Gulag. He has his hand stuck in my leg and is encouraging me to study Stalinist labor camps. Three months later, I pass him in the throat and he says, Lubosh, how's the leg? Are you studying the Gulag like I suggested? Remembered me like it was yesterday. Sounds like he has a good memory. No, I mattered to him. Me, a nobody, mattered to a great man like Talos Rucker. That's the kind of man he is. Sounds like a nice guy. Great, thanks. So there's the elevator. Uh, I don't know if I want to go up it yet. Enter Ark territory. Circumstances prevented Tibor from holding up his end of the bargain, so I had to get creative. The mission's back on track now. Just need to get through the throat and into Ark headquarters to finish it. 
What's this? I don't think I've read this yet. The Rucker Extraction. No, no, I already read that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is... We've had this. Um, so we have these two things here, but I don't want elevator yet. Because I'm hoping that there it will be a shop around here. Where we could, um, sell some goods. Oh, man. How do we get here? <laughs> I don't know. But yeah, there is something here. But look, this is like kind of cordoned off. These steps might take us there. Maybe if I go down, I might find a shop. Pojď si užít, čumáčku. Než tě odlifrujou s ostatníma augama. What? Nenech si ujít něco výjimečného. Něco takového v celém golemu si ty nenajdeš. She a prostitute? Crafting parts up here. I want them. Come to me, crafting parts. You belong to me now. All right. Uh... Is this a shop down here? Yes, I found the shop. Excellent. What's up? Don't try anything. Don't try any anything? You looking for supplies? I'm looking for somebody to buy my supplies from me. Hey, what's up, entity? If you're looking to take a piss, you can do it in the street like everybody else. If you're looking for Virzbowski, you can fuck off. Uh, I'm not looking for either. Well then, handsome. You must be looking to deal. My name's Entity, and I've got the sweetest tech in GC. How may I serve you? So who's, uh, where's Belsky? When I walked in here, you mentioned someone named Wurzbowski. Who is that? My asshole ex. <laughs> he used to run this place with me before he ran out. I thought you were one of his new friends. The kind of welcome you gave me must not think much of his new friends. Don't get me wrong, Ark does a lot of good in the ghetto, but... Your boyfriend fell in with Ark? X. And I get it, I guess. He always wanted to make a difference. Ark keeps a lot of people safe in here. Keeps them fed, clothed. They give a lot of people hope. I get that, but... I don't know. Something about organized anything scares the shit out of me. You think Ark is dangerous? No. I don't know. Maybe. Shit. Probably. But that's not what scares me. It's the collective hive-minded mentality that freaks me out. It's why I stay away from religion. And book clubs. <laughs> so, listen. We're getting to know each other here. Is there... something else I can do for you? Sure. Tell me your story. So how did you wind up dealing tech in Dalham City? All the brothels were full, so I had no choice but to fall back on an old hobby to make ends meet. Which tech company was it that cut you loose? Bobson Synthetics. I was a biocell designer. Then I wasn't. The incident fried some pretty delicate shit in my hand. Can't really do my best work anymore, you know, but... Hey, whatever. That's downer territory. I get by fine. What do you say we change the subject? Sure. Show me what you've got. Well, if you're going to make it sound naughty, <laughs> I have no choice, do I? Hope she's got a lot of credits. Uh, just for fun, let's see what she's got for sale. She's got a multi-tool. Oh, look how much those cost. And she's got a bunch of software. All right, that's cool. Uh, yeah, that's all she's got. And then, let's sell some stuff. Let's sell this battle rifle. I don't need that. Let's sell this tactical shotgun. Uh, and this pistol. Excellent. I don't think I need a mine template. Or a frag grenade. Or sniper rifle regular ammo. Or this nice rye. Sell the hydraulic micro pumps that we've got in our inventory. Gyroscopic regulator. Uh, 
Stem processor chips, chips, a silencer. I don't need that. Both of the weapons I've got already have a silencer on them. I don't need battle rifle regular ammo. Um, I, I'm pretty sure that I already have laser targeting systems on both of these. We'll check though. Keep that, keep that, sell this. Uh, sell this. Sell this. This. <laughs> um. I don't want to sell it. I guess I can't inspect it here. She's going to be angry with us, though. Let's see what she says. That's okay, darling. You change your mind, you know Entity's got everything you need. Maybe there's something else that interests you, though? <laughs> he shakes his head like, no, I don't want it. Actually, Entity, I think I'll just show myself out. Oh, sad face. Well, promise me you won't stay gone too long, darling. Oh, I'm sure I'll be back. Because I've always got stuff to sell, you know? Uh, I wanted to look here just to be sure. Yeah, see, this has the uh, laser targeting system thing on it already. I can't combine it with that, so. Let's sell this off real quick while we're still here. My favorite brooding stranger returns. Come to see what entity has for you, or did you just miss? Bye. Show me what you've got. Well, if you're going to make it sound naughty, I have no choice, do I? You have no choice. None. Zero choice in the matter. Sell. Okay, so we've got some stun gun ammo and we've got some tranquilizer rifle ammo. And then uh, the rest of the stuff I'm going to hang on to. So we freed up a lot of space there, which is cool. I like having space. We could... That's okay, darling. Yeah, we've already seen her say that. Leave, goodbye. Action. Show ourselves out, blah, blah, blah. Alright. Well, that's awesome. I finally, finally found a shop to sell my stuff. It makes me happy. I'm going to uh, hang out here with Entity. Take my, uh, take a break here. And in my play session, when we come back next time, I, I guess we'll explore more of this uh, market and see if there's any other side missions that show up. So far, we haven't found any side missions here in the Udalek complex, and there's got to be some around here. So I think we'll focus on that for a bit before we uh, continue with the main mission. Hope you'll enjoy me. Hope you'll enjoy me, my brother. I hope you'll join me next time. And I hope you have enjoyed this play session. If you did, won't you be so kind as to leave me a like or a comment? And if you're not a subscriber, won't you please consider subscribing? Thank you so much for watching. I hope you join me again in the next episode.